for centuries, sharks have captured our imaginations and inspired our fears. But throughout most of human history, sharks have been misunderstood. They have existed on Earth for several hundred million years, since long before the dinosaurs and hundreds of times longer than humans. On our own research dives, we often encounter sharks. They are usually very curious and coming close to investigate us and our equipment. Although they can sometimes be a bit frisky, they rarely, if ever, pose an actual threat. Sharks aren't the only predators we encounter. Large jacks often follow us during the dive and sometimes even steal our specimens. Apex predators like these thrive in places that are protected from fishing, such as the Papahanaumokuakea Marine National Monument in the northwestern Hawaiian Islands. There are few places left on Earth where you can find healthy populations of these large predators. Sharks will often keep us company during our long decompressions from deep dives. It's always inspiring when they swim among us, and we appreciate the opportunity to observe and photograph them. The most amazing thing we ever see during decompression is the feeding frenzy surrounding a live bait ball. Small bait fish are flying everywhere, tuna are flying everywhere, and of course the sharks are also in on the action. In these high energy, high adrenaline situations, we're always filled with a mixture of excitement and fear. As chaotic as the situation may seem, the sharks know exactly what they are doing and pose no threat to us. Populations of sharks worldwide are in decline. They are harvested for their fins and are a large component of bycatch from longline fisheries. They do not respond well to such pressures because they are slow growing, take many years to reach maturity, and produce few young. Half of all the shark species assessed by scientists are now considered to be threatened or near threatened with extinction. There is no doubt that we are a greater threat to sharks than sharks are to us.